for that procedure, for female, we need to open the legs of the patient, then we will need to keep the labia alone and pass the cotton with the antiseptic or septic solution through all the vulva, then we will keep the labia separated and insert, not insert, and put the collector in the local. If the patient can do it alone, we need to allow it. After give the patient some privacy, we will collect the, all the specimen, then we will need to turn the collector ring in the sterile recipient like that after that we will write uh, information in a label put in the specimen like that and give it to the laboratory to be examined in case of means we should also help the patient to perform his hygiene if he can do it alone we need to give privacy to the patient then we will return and collect the specimen but first we need to explain all the procedure to the patient as not to touch inside the container when catching and uh, try to not contaminated uh, the genital area and the specimen. After catch it, we will ash, wash the external area of the specimen or container, then with the help of a plastic bag, we will put Our specimen, like that, and send it to the laboratory for examination. After every urination, you should take the specimen and a big container, then we will put all the urine during 24 hours in the big recipient. Then, if our hands are dirty, we need to wash our hands and write the hour, the characteristic of the urine and the complements of the patient in the patient chart. Then we will keep our container in the room of the patient with the identifier, the label, and if necessary, we will need to the patient to realize it alone or with a help of a health professional.